I'm not gonna. Why not? I gotta. I have to compose it. No, you you told me a lot in the car. I didn't tell you that much in the car. I really didn't. Um, I personally liked it. It was interesting seeing it in Ypsilanti because every time that dude's dong was on the screen, people were just like, ah! and we also had like funny man sitting behind us, and was like, give it to her. It, it made it a little bit more enjoyable. It was pretty clear that it was straight out of the comic, and they're like, oh, I talk like I'm only one dimensional, two dimensional. That it was just like. Yeah, got yeah, a little old, but it was alright. They portrayed the characters very well. I just kind of wanted to see uh, Night Owl be a little bit fatter and a little bit more lethargic, but it was alright. I think he looked kind of like a, you know, Richard Dreyfus. I enjoyed the alternate ending. It was, you know, opposed to the graphic novel. It was a good movie, but I think you need to read it in order to fully understand it, because I think people didn't understand it very well. Just repeat to me what you just said about Zack oh. Snyder. What, about the uh, Zack Snyder, his whole speed up and then slow down and slow down and speed up thing? Yes. Yeah, I hated that. I mean, I, I hate it anyways, but I, I can deal with that because there, there was not no flying banners like there was in 300. You all know, they were called the Crime Busters in the comic, and it was 1965, not 1970, and they weren't called the Watchmen in any part in the comic. So I bet you everybody's like on Ain't It Cool News right now, blogging away about how it's a travesty and that Frank Miller should have directed it with Alan Moore supervising. Done. And I thought it was pretty good as a movie. I enjoyed um, quite a few scenes. Um, uh, Rorschach, of course, was uh, my favorite character, and uh, he definitely had the, uh, the Batman voice that uh, Christian Bale does so well. Because, you know, we watched it in Ipsy, there was the guy that was like, Man, Ror Rorschach looked like Danny Bonaducci. But, uh, so that made it that made it a little bit more uh it added like the the extra commentary in the in the theater is is funny but I'd probably buy it on DVD when it comes out so like the 4 hour collector's edition Yeah whatever whatever comes out on DVD I'll probably buy it yeah. so um I mean it, it is a lot better than 300 I'm buying mine from Utah where it's edited for uh you know younger So viewers. it has that giant squid in there for you <laughs> Yeah Jason, exactly at the end yeah, giant squid. Yeah. Watchmen. Oh. Uh, no, uh, honestly okay. faithful to the book. Nitpickers are posers. Quit complaining. Douchebag. Uh, action scenes seemed kind of forced. But uh, overall, it was excellent. Yeah. I should bring the Watchmen book with me and, like, follow it. Oh, don't be that guy. You know, there, <laughs> when I went to go see Lord of the Rings, that's what they did. No, there's Bob people Bombadil's there. not in it. There's Tom a, Bombadil's not in it. That's like, yeah, that was... This is retarded. Get out of here.